and welcome. My name is Maria and I'm from Practice Test Academy and today I'm delighted to talk you through the most important steps that you should complete when you're preparing for your strategic case study exam. And I won't stop there. On top of that, I'm going to guide you through our newly designed innovative products that will certainly fast track you to exam success. Now, if you follow our guidance, you'll learn how to get ahead of the game and pass your case study exam with complete and total ease. Let's begin, shall we? The purpose of this video is to make you fully aware of the fundamental steps that you need to complete while you're preparing for your case study exam. And as you can see on the screen, they are as follows. The first one that we have here is reviewing the technical knowledge. And this is not only what's required from you in terms of technical knowledge, but what you already know. And you need to have good understanding of both what's required and what you know. Then we have analyzing the pre-scene and doing this thoroughly from a commercial point of view. In that particular step, it includes a thorough industry analysis too. Then we analyze it from a performance, enterprise and financial point of view. Last but certainly not least, we have practicing mock exams while practicing your writing technique with mock case study answers. And I have to say that many of you are going to find that this is possibly the most crucial step of all. We've put so much thought behind the best possible preparation materials for case study students and we've analysed what's available out there and compared our material just to make sure that we're not only offering more than our competitors, but making sure that we are the most cost effective solution of all. So many students, they get lost in the preparation side of things and we wanted to make your life easier. So we've split our content into manageable weekly chunks. We just want to offer you the best support that any provider could by making it into a step-by-step -step process for you, where you can easily see your progress so you know exactly what you've done and what still needs to be done. Now, one thing to note here is that we've logically split the material into easy to follow steps. Now, these steps are in an order so that in our professional opinion, will be the most efficient and effective way of preparing for your management case study exam. We have the SES Essential Package here, which I'll go through with you today. And as you can see, we also offer three remaining upgraded packages, the SES Advanced, the SES Master and the SES Ultimate Packages. Now, the Advanced, Master and Ultimate Packages, they'll include everything from the Essential Package, but they also have that extra benefit of mocks as well as marking services and one to one tuition and webinars. Now, I'll go into more detail about the upgraded features and add ons shortly. In our first step, we're going to introduce the concept of case studies. We've called it an SES Kickstarter. Now, here you're going to understand what's been examined, what's expected from you, what your role is in the exam, and also how the exam is structured, how to prepare for it, and how to plan and write your answers so that you can maximize your marks. Now, after laying the groundwork, we'll move on to analyzing the pre-scene. First, we'll analyze everything on the document. Now our tutor, they're going to highlight all the important bits and analyze the information presented and expand on it, to give you more real life examples. Industry analysis will also be included in there and you'll find a handy summary document in there too. Then we'll move on to analyzing the pre-scene from each paper's point of view. Now E3 is the leading paper in the strategic case study. So we're going to devote a full week to that. Then we'll spend another week focusing on the P3 perspective. And lastly, we'll wrap up with the F3 paper. In each of the three weeks, we will start off by revising the technical knowledge from the week's theme paper. And it's so important to emphasize early on that these three papers, they are tested in a slightly different way here. It's all about the application of your knowledge, not necessarily what you know. Now, this is why standard revisions of your objective test papers, they might not be very useful for the case study exam. We need to know how you can apply that knowledge to the case study. And this is exactly why we've prepared what we have for you. Then we'll delve into analyzing the pre-scene and we'll dive deep into the E3 threats and opportunities. And with that analysis, it should cover all the necessary E3 I can statements. And to reinforce all that knowledge and information, we will kick off with the writing process. Now we've prepared five tasks for each paper based on the current pre-scene. We believe that writing, particularly writing solutions for mocks, is the most crucial part of your case study preparation. Now, we want you to avoid that the common mistake that most students can make while preparing for their exam. They start doing mocks far too late and sometimes not even under exam conditions. Now, we believe that if you start writing and solving mocks almost from the beginning, you'll find that preparing the structure of your answers and then developing your points will become second nature to you. 
Now that is why we're not only going to get you to write solutions to single paper related tasks, but we also encourage you to start preparing solutions from mocks right from the third week in so that you can cover at least five mocks before you sit your exam. And with the recent launch of our webinars, which has been a great success and due to student demand, we've decided to continue hosting our webinars and we've, we've changed the format ever so slightly, improved it if you like. We will host one webinar at the end of week five, which is included in our premium packages. In the sixth week, we'll focus on ethics, IT hot topics, and again, on mocks. Now, ethics is such an important part of every case study, and in almost every exam variant, you'll find that there's a task related to ethics, and this is why we've developed a condensed course on that topic. Now, since SEMA is going into the direction of digitalization and automation, we've also prepared an insightful course on IT hot topics too. And before I forget, our expert Nisha, she's prepared a document showing you the areas that are frequently examined and how you can effectively approach them. We have not missed a trick here at the Academy. Everything for your case study exam is covered. Now let's look at the final week, a time in which your confidence should be well and truly boosted. We'll summarize what we've covered so far and you'll get some last minute tips for the day of your exam. Now we've recently launched the ultimate package and we've added a personal tutor assistant in there offering you three individual one-to-one -one tutoring sessions. And a tutor will check your progress on a weekly basis and also send you personalized emails. You should definitely get your mocks checked. Now, can you imagine constantly repeating the same mistake? If no one ever mentioned it to you, it left you to repeat that same mistake over and over again. Now, by getting your mocks professionally checked, you'll get a chance for somebody else, possibly from an examiner's point of view, to assess what you've written and how you've worked out your answers. Our tutors will verify your answers and give you tips on areas in which you can improve. Now, this valuable service only costs £45 a mock as an add-on, or it's included if you subscribe to our advanced master and ultimate packages from the start. So there you have it, a walkthrough of what our tool includes and how it can help you maximize your chances in passing your next strategic case study exam. Thank you so much for listening. We wish you every success in your next exam.